everyone, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to lead you through a quick 10 minute booty burn workout and you will need a booty band for this circuit. Make sure that you can see your screen so you can follow along with me and make sure you have something soft beneath you. And without further ado, let's get to it. All right guys, first up, we're starting off with some side to side steps. So you're gonna feel that resistance on the band as you step out, your body's slightly leaning forward feeling those outer glutes fire up. And from here, without taking any rest in between, for the next 30 seconds, we're gonna do just some regular banded squats. as you come down, feel that resistance on the band. Keep pressing those knees out and then press through your heels to stand up. From here, next 30 seconds, we're gonna kind of combine those two. So side step, you're gonna pulse in your squat, then come up, other side, step it out, pulse together. Good work, we're taking a 30 second rest and then we're going to repeat that whole section once again. So we're gonna start off with our side to side steps, then right away moving into our squats. When you're doing your side to side steps, your body's gonna be slightly hinged forward and your knees are always going to stay bent and you're gonna stay at the same height. You're just moving that leg apart from the band bringing it together, really focusing on those outer glutes. Getting ready to go into our squat. Here we go, all the way down. When you come up, keep a slight bend in your knees and keep your body angled forward so those glutes are still engaged. Press those knees out. Feel the resistance on that band. Good, adding those two together and adding a pulse to our squat. Good work. All right, taking a 30 second rest, we're gonna head down to the ground. First up, we're gonna do the same kind of thing. We're gonna do three exercises back to back, 30 seconds each. First up, you're just gonna do some regular glute bridges. You're gonna make sure that you feel the resistance on that band. Press those heels into the floor. Press those hips up as high as you can go without letting those knees cave inward and without letting those hips drop. You wanna just press everything up and out, come down, just tap that booty to the floor, send it right back up. Yeah, I'm going on it. 
From here, you're still gonna continue doing glute bridges, but at the top of your glute bridge, you're gonna open those knees up, bring them back together, and then down. When you're opening those knees, make sure you're not dropping those hips. Keep those hips pressed as high as you can, and then lower. Good, from here, you're just doing abductions. So you're holding those hips up to the sky and just opening and closing those knees. I know your booties are burning, but that's the whole point of this workout, isn't it? Good, release, bring those knees into your chest. Give those buns a bit of a break. We're gonna repeat that whole section again. Here we go, starting off with glute bridges. Make sure you feel that resistance in the band already. Lower backs pressed to the floor. Sink into those heels and press the hips up. Getting ready to add an abduction to the top of our glute bridge. Getting ready to just do abductions. Here we go, 30 seconds, you can do it. Keep those hips pressed up. All right, let's flip it over into tabletop. You're gonna choose one leg to work with at a time. First up, you're gonna do a kick back to a donkey kick. So kick back, you're pushing back, pressing that heel back and stretching the leg. Then you're gonna bring it in for a donkey kick so leg stays bent 90 degrees. Lift the heel to the ceiling, bring it back in. Here we go. Make sure you're pressing that working hip down into the floor. You're not opening the leg up here. Driving it down so your hips are square. We're gonna use that same leg and now we're gonna do fire hydrants. So you're gonna open the knee up to the side and bring it in. So upper body should be still. You should. Just be moving that leg. Good work, we're taking a 15 second rest, then we're gonna do the other leg, and then we're done. Here we go. 
kick back to donkey kick. Really squeeze that glute, press that heel to the ceiling when you're doing that donkey kick. Try not to arch the back, keep a neutral spine. Getting ready for 30 seconds of fire hydrants. Same leg. it guys great job i hope you enjoyed this quick 10 minute booty burn workout if you did give this video a thumbs up let me know how you guys enjoyed it in the comments down below if you're new here hit that subscribe button turn on your post notifications so you don't miss another video from me and i'll see you guys very soon bye